I went to grad school and got a PhD in political science. And when I finished that, I got a job uh, teaching at Duke, which was very enjoyable. But I wasn't able to convert that into a permanent position. And at that point, I didn't really know what to do with myself. So because I couldn't figure out anything else to do, I decided to enroll in law school. My second summer, I worked in a big law firm and I really hated it. So it became clear to me that I didn't want to go back to that firm after graduation and practice, that I didn't really want to practice for a big law firm. I looked for some other legal jobs. I came up empty. I couldn't find anything. So I didn't know what I was going to wind up doing for a living. Here I was, you know, 34 years old, uh, with a lot of education, but not a clear career trajectory. So this encouraged me to think creatively and I started thinking about what I really liked and I went back to when I had been at Duke and I thought about how even though I didn't really want to publish that I really enjoyed teaching, it turned out just coincidentally that there was an opening in the humanities department. So I applied, I got that job and now I've been here for 14 years and I'm very happy in the position and enjoy it very much. So it was really through a series of failures that felt like failures at the time and that felt very discouraging that I wound up ultimately redirecting my energies in a way that I had not thought about earlier and I wound up in a position that feels very natural for me and that I really enjoy.